Good morning, everyone. It's, uh, what time is it? It's uh, about 11 o'clock, it's 36 degrees. It is a crisp morning and a bit of a late start on Growing Hearth, on the Growing Hearth farm. Uh, and I wanted to take a minute to, um, to uh, sort of do a show and tell of one of the my more useful creations since we moved out here. And that's, uh, well, let me flip you around here. Um, uh, the, uh, what do you call it? Uh, uh, truck crate? I don't know. Uh, bed, cage, uh, whatever, that uh, I built for the truck. Now, you see the trailer back there. We were, I was about to haul livestock, and a bearing went out. Uh, I was running late, and it's been about 45 minutes mocking up something like this, and it turned out to be super useful. Now, I think probably every truck's different, but uh, on my particular truck, there's uh, a little uh, post hole. Uh, and most trucks have these in some way or another. And inside there's a little uh, little metal pocket. Excuse me. Excuse me. Can you guys calm down? Thank you. Anyway, so I had to rip down part of it and make a bit of a shoulder. And that actually lines up perfectly with the, uh, with the gate so that I can um, uh, put in whenever the uh, whenever the bed is up, uh, I have a gate with verticals that fit behind this and the uh, and the tailgate and uh, horizontals that cross and go in front of this. So I don't really have to have a uh, uh, any sort of fastening device. I just slide it in and it, and it works perfectly. But we hauled seven sheep in this. Uh, and uh, turned out to be more useful than I thought. Uh, and really, it's just the four posts. And then I wrapped it around, and that's how we hauled the sheep. And I built the uh, the gate for the uh, for the tailgate. Uh, and then later on, I beefed it up a little bit and put a little bit of decking on here um, on both sides, so that that weight would be sitting directly on the posts. Because uh, you have to remember this about nails and screws is that they're meant to hold things together. They're not meant to hold weight. So if I would put weight directly onto this uh, with just the screws holding into the post, it wouldn't have worked out so well for me. Uh, but yeah, uh, I don't trust it with too, too much weight. Uh, but 22 by 6s that are 16 foot long is plenty of weight. Uh, and it leaves my bed open uh, to move more lumber uh, down here. Uh, so yeah, just some different ideas. If you're hauling hay, um, you'll have to have a different sort of arrangement for this part so that you can put uh, big round bells in there. Square, bell, square bells wouldn't be an issue at all. And um, let's see, what else? Uh, another idea I had after I put the, the decking on the top is that if I had put decking all the way across, this would be a really great uh, camping situation. You see those... Uh, um, tents that sit on top of vehicles um, and, and that would be excellent for that uh, but yeah that's my arrangement it turned out to be really useful I can haul livestock I can haul 16 foot lumber uh, on a uh, six six and a half foot bed works out pretty well sorry had to pause there for a minute um, but yeah that's the uh, that's, I don't what do you call that I, the words in my head. I don't know. I, I feel like I think visually, so like I, I lose words a lot, which uh, which may not be the most helpful thing when you're vlogging. But uh, uh, today we'll be putting up some more uh, uh, roof joists or ceiling joists and uh, roof rafters, and um, hopefully, hopefully we can get this thing dried in by next week. Uh, really looking forward to that because we need to pick. We need to get our stuff. Uh, that the Navy moved. I think we're approaching the end of our time that they'll hold it. Uh, so, yeah. let's. Uh, as long as we can get it dry, we can put our stuff in there and we can work around it. Uh, either that or get one of those pod storage, uh, storage uh, systems uh, where they put the, the storage unit uh, in your driveway or whatever and uh and store it there it would be nice um to have a lot of my tools back i'll tell you that 
anyway, uh, we'll maybe do a video later. Um, but for right now, yesterday's video, I promised a shot of the ducks and the chicks and I completely forgot before the end of it and uploaded it. So uh, here you guys go.